definition of hooligan racing, I would say it's the grassroots of dirt track racing. You know, taking a bike that could possibly be street legal, turning it into a race bike, and then uh, running it week in, week out without worrying about things. I mean, the fact that we're riding bikes designed to be ridden on the street on the dirt, it's not real smart. You know, I rode this chopper here from really far away and I'm gonna race it today. That's f***ing hooligan. Just, it's just another flat track class. I just love flat track racing and if they made uh, a bagger class, I'd probably do it too. It doesn't really matter. I just love flat track racing. I showed up, fucking Stewart's already drinking beer. There's, I mean, everybody's high-fiving, everybody's stoked to see each other. Uh, it's, it's the best part, really, is hanging out here. Um, I think it will kind of separate. I think some of the bikes and riders are probably a little discouraging for new riders, maybe. They see bikes and fast, and I don't want them to get discouraged. I want to build them up, you know, and. So I like sharing information, sharing setup, sharing as much as I can just to get them over that hump so that they don't get discouraged. The best part is, is all these motherfuckers are losing today and I'm winning. <laughs> the worst part is, is there's a slight chance that might not be the case. <laughs> is just a microcosm of flat track as a whole and it's just one little part of it so I don't want to discourage people to not try a 450 or buy an XR100 and go to a district race and have fun. Find a cheap sportster and dirt track tires some 19s and some handlebars and go out there and get some practice. In. Stay at home, get a dog, just stay on the tip, don't even come out, you won't have any fun.